been a hot minute since I played. Oh, everybody's gone from here, I just realized. We have, I, I am getting chased by a tornado, as you will see. Let's look at these new pictures. These new pictures are not the tornado, but that's okay. Uh, oh, it's a guitar string. Wow, your scrapbook thing is mad cool. Um, yeah, I haven't quite... Oh, boy. Controller vibration. That's a thing. I tried playing this game with a mouse and keyboard briefly, and uh, it's okay, I guess. Right, you'll, see, you'll see the tornado. I'm thinking ferret with the extra items is holy pines. So yeah, so when uh, the tornado comes, I need to use this uh, UFO looking item. There's no music. Oh, did I turn the music off? Oh, okay, hang on. No, I didn't. Dude, let's just turn it up. Bump it. Yeah, I'd like to apply the changes. Wait a minute. Whoa. Oh, oh, oh. Alright, so it's sucking me in. So, did I use the item? I think I did. And then it just, like, poops us out, and then we're good. Oops, that was the wrong item to use. Oh, no. That's okay. I think I broke it. I might have broken it. Maybe there's no music because these dudes are not here. You know what I'm saying? Like the dudes were providing the music, so since they're gone. Holy pines! I find this zone to be very difficult. Where's my storm shield? I wonder if I can just use the storm shield forever. Yay. Oh, okay. It expires. Give me another totem. Yippee. First part is... Pa oh, that was a propeller. Got it. I said to spend items to get to a, uh, a shield. Poop. Poop. Poop, I say. Oh, it takes time. Oh, yeah, I'm going to switch pets. So the cool thing about the uh, ferret, I think, is that it just gives you extra. Like, there's an extra button for a tool. Like, that's mad strong. Like, why would you not want that? Hey. Child versus nature. Bummer. The mole is the worst. Like, if you boost, you take damage. You just take damage. It seems like I have, like, unlimited of the uh, storm shields, so I should try to use them more often. I think they time out, but I could, I could use them a lot more than I am. I could use them to block a totem and then just, like, have a bunch of other 
tools ready to go. I think the order though is like shield then totem. Oh, that was so close. me out into the thing. Oops. Nice. Oh, 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 hello. What, what the hell was that? What the hell just happened? Hmm. I didn't realize it would toss stuff at me. It didn't do that the entire other time. I'm going to call shenanigans on that one. Come on, man. I was feeling great about it, and then it just like... It's over here raining on my parade is what it's doing. Yeah, I feel like I turned the music off somewhere. Difficulty normal. Here's the credits. I wonder what like easy would do. Like what does the difficulty change? Like, look at that. Aha! I didn't, I was looking at the bottom, huh? I kind of wish that like the icons were in a more centralized location and specifically like weren't blocking the right side of the screen. Like, I think it's cool that like it keeps it over there. So I'm looking at it, but in keeping my eye in the right side of the screen, I feel like what's actually happening is it's just blocking my view of what's coming up next. And then I, I feel like a lot of my deaths come across as being cheap because just like hey the pumpkin patch it comes up really fast and if i dare look at the bottom left of the screen to just see what's coming up because my my minion or whatever my pet has given me an item then i'm screwed oh my god that's so irritating need to use that. Okay. Less than halfway remains. I'm thinking about lowering the difficulty though, because at this point, like, I think the gameplay has been kind of cute, but um, as it's gone on, I have enjoyed it like a little bit less and less. So if we die like a few more times, I'm probably going to try to bump it down and see what happens. I don't know that like, you know, like I'm not really concerned with like the achievements or anything. I kind of wonder what happens if you like put the difficulty all the way down. Like do they assist you or are things less frequent? Do you drive slower? Did I 
see damage from that? I did it. Like that. Like, come on. Okay. Yeah, let's just, like, lower the difficulty. Let's just see what happens. Genuinely con uh, interested in seeing. Um, how did I get to the options? Options. Ride. Yeah, so I, I guess the thing that's kind of difficult here is like, okay, so they have four different difficulty options, and I don't know what any of them mean. Uh, did I like accidentally mute it? I really am not sure. Let's see what changes. Maybe nothing. <clears throat> yeah, a lot of the situations just feel like complete RNG as to whether or not, like, things go through. Like, if I finish a level, it genuinely feels like a complete roll of the dice. I don't think it's the intention. Oops. Yay. Oh, hello. Didn't have a propeller for that part. Oh god. It like picked me up immediately. Like that, that sucked. That completely sucked. Like, I was fine, and then all of a sudden the tornado pulled me in. It didn't appear like the tornado was pulling me in at all. I'm gonna lower the difficulty again. I feel like we've lost the music, which is kind of a bummer. I don't know why that's the case. <laughs> I wonder if the difficulty just doesn't do anything. Yeah, you know, like, there's situations where, like, hey, if, if I was doing the, uh, if I was just, like, going through, like, casually, and, uh, like, three totems popped up and I didn't get a shield for them, then I would just lose, and that doesn't feel good at all. But, like, if another totem pops up, nothing I can do about it. I could have spent my storm shield, but apparently... Dude, just pop up faster. What is wrong with you? Yippee. Oh, I blocked it with the other thing. That's... Oh God. The tornado thing is too subtle. Like, I, I am not noticing the tornado thing at all. Hmm. Yeah, you know? Difficulty doesn't appear to have done anything. Yeah, like the random items just dropping. I'm not really ready. It, it only happens here. I would like to boost more, but I just realized that I don't know what's coming up. So boosting would be extremely scary. Pulling me in? I'm confused. <laughs> 
pulling me in. Pulling me in now. Pulling me in now. Oh, that was an object. Okay, thanks a lot. I kind of want a timer. You can chain these, like, propellers. It just requires a little bit of timing, I think. Okay. If the tornado was going to pull me in right there or not, uh, I have no idea. Complete roll of the dice as far as I'm concerned. Oh wow, where'd the sky go? Why are there skulls? Alright, here we go. Great totem. I'm glad every place has totems. Why is that the case? Whoa. I'm not gonna make it, huh? Should have jumped and then propellered, maybe. Whoa, look up, check this guy out. Check this goat out. Oh, check out this. Hey, fluffy ears, it's you. What? How can I get over these mountains? You better turn and go back, kid. No. You have no idea what awaits you if you keep going. But isn't it the whole point of an adventure? So you're an adventurer, huh? Not really, I just want to go see the summer and you see the ocean. It has been a dream of mine. Uh, but I always end up in some kind of adventure as I travel. Oh, so you want to get sunburned and fill your shoes with sand? Yes. Fine, anything to get rid of you so I can watch my TV show. Let's do the following. Collect sticks. All right. Down to collect sticks. <clears throat> Oops. Okay, so he's also got a new scooter and then a new monk okay don't have enough greetings from the rocky mountains the rocky mountains all right no trees no bushes it sounds like i wouldn't have a job there this windy monster is something dangerous for sure be careful and take care of your car by the way people say that crow is searching for someone I only hope it's not for you in any case be extremely cautious uh, dear funny bear, thanks for the warning. I'm really far from the woods. I don't think he could find me now. By the way, can you see the mountains on the horizon? They, uh, they even higher, they even higher than they look. And even here, I have found another FR shop. Sad, though, that the ocean can't be seen from any way out here. Try it again. Hello, scary black crow. I have visited so many different places. It's so much fun to meet new people and become their friends. You should try it someday. Wow, that's kind of... Um, okay. Greetings, human child. I am busy. There is still a lot of work for me uh, here. Right now, I am trying to calm down one angry bear. He says that someone who looks like a beaver has woken him up and broken his excavator with massive stones. Hey, dear guy. Boy, that bear had a crazy dream. I saw a real tornado. Um, it's a dirty wind that looks like one of your horns. Can I ask you a personal question? Um, okay. Hey, Mr. Healthy. How are you doing? Did you find new pants? Got it. Cool. LB. Did it, did it, did it, did it. New. Cool. How many more are there? One, two, three, four, four. Wow. A lot more video game here than I thought. Um, okay. Let's continue. Let's continue on with our adventure. Wow, I really do have a scooter. What the hell is that? Is it to counter my always being propelled strategy? Oh, I have to collect sticks. No. That wasn't the right solution. Oh, I have to use the... This. Okay. 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 <laughs> 
Okay, I have to jump and then use the clippers. Oh god. I, it moved, it didn't move down like I anticipated for some reason. I don't know why I did that. Oh man, jeez, it did move up that time. It like, come on, man, jeez. Some of these like things are completely gnarly. Yay. Just look at this little cute, cute little goat. Adorable. Can I feed him something? He only eats flowers that grow on totems. Hold on, little cutie. Yeah, little cutie. Oh, that's right. I needed to buy a thing. You need to save for that cute hat. It's more important than whatever the hell we're doing. Yay! Yay! I'm a cutting machine. Okay, didn't even see that one. God. These challenges sometimes. Ugh. Like, why? Why? Like, literally, why? So, what was this supposed to be there? Supposed to jump with a shield? Okay, well, I wasn't getting that one. Happened to be low enough. Whoosh. That looks cool, whatever's going on back there. Oh, and never mind, those are explosions, am I right? God, it moved up. Ah, why have I never had this problem until now? That one didn't move up. Okay, that one didn't move up. Oh, it didn't, it didn't move the up. It didn't move up. I pressed the button to go up and then it just didn't. I hate using tools for these challenges. I hate it so much. So that one didn't move up that time. It like technically stayed at the spot that I was at. <laughs> yeah, thanks. Jeez. That was so close. Oh, you know. Great. At least there's a sound cue for the propeller. I don't have it. <laughs> Okay, well, I'm only buying jumps and, oh, I guess we should buy shields for the thing. I feel like this is the only time where I've like actively lost money. Yeah, so we're only doing the objective.
Goodie. What was that about? What was that about? Oh, great, great. Couldn't reach it. I want to save for the outfit before I buy anything else. Yeah, so I feel like I should be buying equipment so I could get used to it. I actually don't like buying equipment. I think buying the equipment is dumb. Look at that. Great. Hmm. I wonder if maybe only some of the totem totems have the to totems? Only some of the totems have the, uh, the thing. I'm saving for the thing. I'm saving. Yeah, and like the worst, you know, idea of how to play, like, you know, like there's no value to getting far. Like I might as well just not buy anything really or not buy or use anything until I finish the objective and then try to get far because like the game, I mean, I guess you get more mushrooms, but other, like, I don't know. Why, why should I bother? Yeah, I think you jump right there. In a world where, like, we imagine this as a deck building game, I feel like maybe what I want is to, like, if you want to determine, like, the weight of the cards or whatever, or how frequently you might get them, then, or, like, the power-ups, then that might be kind of cool. But having to buy them every run is so frustrating, especially when there's other stuff. Like, you know, I really don't care how far I get. Like, I don't care if I do 100 runs of dying after three obstacles to get the outfit. Like, I want to get the outfit. We're like, we're going to do this until I get the, I think it's 500, so I might be able to just buy the outfit now. But if it was 800, I would be doing this until 800 and I wouldn't use any parts. Shepherd. Monk. Huh, three more, huh? Yeah, and so now that we're just looking for, oh my god. Now that I'm just looking to complete the side objective, I'm just going to do the side objective. Yeah, so now I might get jumps. Thanks. I still don't think the difficulty changed that either. Am I wrong? Did it. I don't know what those are. Those look like vaguely mechanical. Well, well. I turned off my heater and now it is extremely, extremely cold. All right. <clears throat> Yeah, having to jump and then use a button to use the skill to do the side mission, mad annoying. Not interested at all. Ah, I hate this game. I hate this game right now so much. Ugh, it moved. I don't know why I tried to move it. I just used a bunch of powers that wouldn't do anything. Yeah, 
I, I genuinely have no idea where the cursor is going to end up when I press the button. Okay, I'm out of power up. I have a limited number of scissors. Why? That's it. That's all I want. <laughs> I hate this so much. I am not enjoying this now. I'm out of jumps. Wait, I'm out of shears. Did I finish the quest? Still need more sticks. How did I run out of scissors? Yeah, so I don't have any more scissors. So I'm done. Might as well just die. Mm. Yeah, wow, it is really cold when I turn my heater off. I can hear myself think though. Which is really scary. Yeah, the um, flowers are on the totem, so I need to jump into them, I guess. Not like that. I need to do better. Like that. Oh, except I've used everything. Okay, I'm not gonna use it! You know, I think I have unlimited as long as I keep drawing tools. Right, there you go, we did it. Completed the side objective. Well, well. All right, what's the next objective to do? Nope. Collect the blank black slime. I kind of want to focus on this totem thing. I need to figure out if I can just like jump into it or not. So black slime, huh? Hello. I think some of these totems don't have flour them. Yeah. Oh, oil. I get it. I don't need the bubble. Okay, that's okay. All right, but I need jumps to collect it. Right, this isn't gonna give me a flower. Nice. Glad we can just not collect the item. Makes me feel great. No flower on that either. It could happen to anyone. Yeah, I hope the fan isn't like obnoxiously loud now. Really weird turning it off because then I'm just like, oh, I can hear again. <laughs> oh, it's quiet. There's no flowers on that. The hell is this? Give me some dumb flowers. No flowers on that either. 
What's the point? Yeah, th so the real problem here is that the game does the game does not just reward you for getting far. Like if you get far in a run, the game has like nothing for you really. Other than just like you got far, I guess. You got a lot of mushrooms kind of. But then what are mushrooms really? So like until you finish all the objectives, there's like not really any I should just have died. Um there's not really any point to like trying to get far. Like you should just try to do the objectives and then that's it. Yeah, and the, unless these flowers only spawn like way later, which they haven't communicated to me, and I don't think is the case, then I don't. Okay, there's no flowers. Great. If there's no flat bubble at the beginning, I'm just not going to jump. Okay. Like, to me, there's, like, almost no point to using the items at all if I'm trying to do the objectives. Because, like, I feel like in, the, in an ideal world, I would be playing the game normally and trying to get a good run and then also be doing the objectives not doing the objectives and then have the run be like this run is nothing i'm gonna use all the shields you know what else. Okay. i feel like the flower was like at the beginning before How am I supposed to get out from here? How indeed? Okay, I'm sweating. Bummer. I'm either too hot or too cold. dead again. Yeah, there weren't even totems there. There wasn't anything for the objective. But see, the problem, I've, I've done the same thing every single time, and then sometimes I'm doing the objective, so just sometimes it's gonna get done, and then other times it's just not. No flowers. Maybe there's just no flowers. I don't know why you would do that, goat. I stand by if there's no bubble at the beginning. We don't jump. That's kind of bizarre. We need a propeller for like. Okay. That's okay. I can spend the five on that. That's fine. Hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking the flowers, like the other flowers, are going to be later in the run, but I have no reason to believe that. Other than the fact that I haven't seen one. But the problem is, like, the fact that I haven't seen one could just be very unlucky. And I, I have no way to really tell. Not 
Not again. We're gonna get there. Oh, geez. The controller vibrated fine. Yo! Yo! Give me some flowers. Oh, it was low. Uh, why are you like this? Why is this game like this? I didn't think I'd be able to get that one. All right. A goat. Wait, it went after me from behind? Why did it do that? That seems obnoxious. What did I do? Just like, don't, buddy. Yeah, so there was a flower at the beginning. So, uh, I wouldn't have got the bubble. There's a lot of detail in the bubble for how little detail is on my character. <laughs> or, like, shading, I guess. Taking dunk in the oil. Yuck. What was inside? X. Exhibit was inside. Mind you, I put the game on like whatever the easiest difficulty was. So uh, at this point, it feels like nothing has changed. Like the difficulty is just like a complete like lie. Like nothing, it doesn't do anything. Oh, there was a flower on that one. Oh, I got it. Turns out just die on the totem and then you'll get the flower. Oops, that was the wrong button to press. Awesome. Awesome, 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 awesome. I'm dead. Oh dear. Collect salt. All right. I wonder how you collect salt. I wonder if you jump into it. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, 
Okay, it does not substitute for a jump. Just had to know, you know? Oh, sweet, another puzzle. Hello, nice to see you. I'm pretty sure you'll try to lead me somewhere again. Rhythm game, rhythm game. I want a rhythm game, I want a rhythm game. Waterfall white noise, waterfall white noise. Okay. Oh, we're going behind the waterfall. Cool. Cool. What is this place? Oh, it's a water puzzle. Okay. I totally need that. Okay. Can rotate a lot. for yet more water. Catch it with the bucket. Um, it gets super stuck. Handled. Bucket physics. Oh God, bucket physics. Got it. Ugh, you gotta be joking. Like, why am I doing this part? I figured out the puzzle. Just give me the, the item. Alright, got it. Gotcha. I almost gotcha. I gotcha, gotcha. I got a rock. Got an infinity stone! Oh, a bucket with mystery. Wait, I'm taking the bucket too? 
Why don't I just take the mystery? Okay, that's fine. Right, what am I doing? I forgot. Collect salt. Got it. Bucket. Spoilers on the picture of the bucket, by the way. I missed one random item, right? The deer. The deer. I really messed up with the deer. Could Anybody could have messed up with the deer, right? Can't hold that one against me. Pleasant sound when you die. That's pretty cool. Or crash your vehicle when you die. I didn't use any items. Nine nine nine. Oh, we're just banking mushrooms, really. At least I'm fine. Did I use any items? Didn't. Yeah, so I kind of want a boost maybe for the bridges. I need a propeller for the rocks. The boost for the bridge or something for the bridges is more important though, because if you fuck up the bridges, then you don't like, like the run is over. There's no like questions about that one. Nice. I'm saving for totem so I can get the flowers or whatever. Let's have yet to show up. And apparently I don't need the, if I'm lucky enough, I don't need the jump either. Yeah, in general, like if you fail the run really quickly, you're not penalized. So technically like doing this is better than whatever I would have been doing. Okay, I need to jump higher to do that. No flowers. Yeah, that's kind of pissy that it's not just like a universal like, hey, if you want the, the flowers, they'll be at the top of the totem. Because that means like, I have to like quickly register like where the flower is on the totem. And then if it's kind of low, then I have to start making a decision of just like, okay, well maybe I need to wait on the jump. Right, that was incredibly lucky. That's what that was. Yeah, but so now we're at the point where I'm just like, okay, well, I'm not buying any power-ups now that I finished the flower thing. Hey, cutie. Yay. Look what I have for you. You discovered a pet. Rams through obstacles. Hell yeah, rams through obstacles. <laughs> Will the obstacles be other goats? <laughs> because, you know, that's a, kind of hilarious. Yippo! Aha! I'm spending all my tools. Yeah, this could have been a situation where like, I'm, I'm kind of on the level now where I'm just like, I wish they had universal powers or something. Like, if this is, <laughs> maybe, like, it's kind of like a deck building game. And part of me, based on, like, these missions, kind of wishes it wasn't. Because, like, if there was just a universal jump ability and you just used it in different ways, and that, I feel like that would be cooler than having a jump tool and then having a secondary jump and ground slam tool for this mission specifically. 
Oh, here's the problem with not having more things. I only get three per run. Oh, I'm done. Doesn't matter. This is the run. Yeah, you know, we have this like weird platformer. Or it could be like a weird platformer instead of like a cardy deck building. Because I'm not really sure that like I like what it is. Collect feathers. Huh? All right, let's see where the feathers are. <laughs> Here's the min maxing that I'm going to do. If the feathers appear at the bottom, I'm not going to get any items. And we're just going to roll the dice. Okay, I have to jump to get them. Oh, okay. I have to collect the feathers from live birds. So majestic. I wish I could join your flock. Bye. Just jump up. You got mad. Uh, I guess if she jumped, it would be twice her height. All right. I'm ready. Good run. Only jumping for feathers. Dot com. my goat where was my goat <laughs> kind of wonder what the boss of this area is a big goat I feel like it's incredible that we haven't gotten any birds in the first section Happen one of these times, maybe. Oops. Oops. Oopsie. Yeah, there's sound cues for this. Oh, they freak out when you pick up some feathers. That's understandable. Yeah, I feel like I, I, I could feel better about the game in general if it was more consistent about stuff like that. Like, the birds get a sound cue, and then nothing else really does. Like, the rocks get a sound cue, but then there's no cue for totems, there's no cue for obstacles, there's, like, a camera pan for jumps, and then there's nothing for other things. Particularly things that require the propeller. Other than the, like, the rocks are pretty exceptional. Most of the time, a thing that would require the propeller has no cue for it whatsoever which is incredibly frustrating that was uh, eight eight I don't need to keep up buying the jumps. Is that... Probably never gonna spend 
more than three. Do a couple more runs. If I get another run where like I don't see any birds, then uh, whoops. Um, yeah, I'm probably gonna. I'm probably not gonna finish this game though. I have enjoyed it the further that we've gone along, which is extremely unfortunate. I really enjoy the aesthetic parts of the game, and like the story or whatever is kind of charming. Um. But like actually playing the game, I find to be a little bit frustrating. I think maybe in like a mobile format or something where it's a little bit more disposable, where you know, uh, I'm not playing it for like an hour in a sitting or something, then I might uh, be a little bit more forgiving of it. But as it stands, like just trying to sit and play the game is extremely frustrating. Like the runs don't feel like they have a lot of real consequence long term and then you know you could just have a really unlucky run and I think there are formats for it to be unlucky and still feel satisfying but I don't think this is really caught it for me in particular now let's do one more run I'm not even gonna see what the boss fight is you know whatever Boss fight is probably cool. Boss fight is probably a giant goat. Super lucky. The game heard me talking shit and they were just like, oh fuck, we gotta we gotta give him more birds. gotten this thing yet. Well, that's spooky. I wonder what all those mean. can't say I'm shocked. What does that mean? All right, there you go. That's Summer Catchers, though. It's available on Steam as well as other devices uh, that aren't just Steam. Uh, so if you want to play the game or check it out, most likely do better than I am doing, uh, then uh, you can do that.